This is the SoCal Update. I'm Kara Santa Maria. Coming up, how an Asian American dancer and singer found her own voice in art and activism. It's Friday, June 11. Asian American and Pacific Islander actors face challenges of limited and stereotypical roles, but in the late 60s, dancer, singer, and actress Nobuko Miyamoto found her own voice as an activist. In her new book, Not Yo Butterfly, out on June 15th, she speaks of her journey using art for social change. Nobuko, could you tell us about your book and what inspired you to write it? Well, my life and my work as an activist span some very significant moments. I was a child of Japanese relocation. I worked as a dancer in show business, and I witnessed the civil rights and black power movement. Then I was able to connect with the Asian American movement, and there I found my own voice. Sing a song for I helped create songs that sang who we were and what we believed in, and that changed my life. And to this day, I'm a community artist, and I wanted to document my story because my story is more than my story. Do you see yourself as equal parts artist and activist? Absolutely. My work in the community uh, is also being an organizer, using the arts, but finding ways to engage community. And we do that not only with our own Japanese American community, but across borders, working with the Latino community, working with the Black community, because this is a time like no other. I think that what happened in Atlanta and the Asian hate around us tells us that people in the United States really don't know who Asian Americans are still after more than a hundred years being here. <laughs> 